did it start? <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay, sorry, I'm new at this. Um, so welcome back everybody. I've been getting a lot of requests to do a video on my new car, which is the Audi Q5. Okay, no, it's not new, but new to me. Um, so here is my Audi Q5. It's like a smaller SUV. Um, I do not have my Honda Accord anymore. Sorry. And this is not a stick shift, so it's not as entertaining to watch me drive it. So I'm probably not going to drive it unless you guys want me to drive it. Um, but this is a all-wheel drive 2.0 um, engine. I've really been liking it so far because my driveway is really steep and I needed something all-wheel drive. Um, but I did love the Audi and... My boyfriend's an Audi mechanic, so we're kind of an Audi family now. Um, it's pretty sharp looking, pretty sleek. It's got tinted windows and a nice uh, roof rack there. <clears throat> so inside we got black leather interior um, throughout, which is really, really nice. Um, heated front seats, leather steering wheel, got the navigation system. Uh, the, like the two cup holders and the little knobby thing. <laughs> Mine came with the rubber mats, which is super nice and convenient to have. Um, electronic chair in the front, chairs in the front, and it has like this kind of wood-looking plastic. It's not wood, but it looks kind of woody. It's brown. I actually don't mind it. I think it looks kind of cool. Sorry, I have my jeans back in. So the, the back is kind of small, it's not that big. Um, but the seats do come forward so that you can put stuff in the back. And there's a little pull down with a cup holder in there. And then you have the, um, the heat and cool adjustment vents here, the back seat. And I love the, um, what do you call this, like a moon roof or something? It has like the really long uh, sunroof, which is super nice. And then the trunk, you can open by pressing the button or by using the keys and holding this button in the middle. And then it opens, which is also very convenient when you have like a whole bunch of groceries in your hand. Um, I got this plastic tray for in the back so it doesn't get dirty. And then you can just press the little button here and it will close it. And then um, when you did get out of your car and you want to lock your car, you just put your thumb on this little thing. And then it locks it and the um, mirrors go down in. So that's also nice. You don't have to put your keys in. And then you can unlock it again by just putting your hand on it and then it'll open. So, well, I guess that's pretty much it. Um, overall, love the vehicle. Haven't had any problems with it so far. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Bye.